From one major Gulf Coast industry to another, hundreds of people from all over the world have arrived in Mobile for the World Leisure Congress. This conference is held every two years, and Mobile is the first city in the United States to host the six-day conference. News 5's Lakia Stinchcomb spoke with local representatives to find out how this conference could affect the local economy. The 2014 World Leisure Congress has finally arrived in the city of Mobile. This is the first time that this conference has been held in the United States, and the mayor couldn't be more pleased. The theme of this is enhancing the human condition, and they have some of the brightest minds in the country that are coming to make presentations and speakers, and this is a, a very important event. Close to 500 people are attending the conference this year, and they are representing more than 40 countries. We've been planning this for several years, and so it, it took a lot of great work and a lot of vision of uh, folks, and also so a lot of financial support from the city as well as the county. Many of the folks attending the World Leisure Congress are staying in downtown Mobile. And restaurants are hoping for an increase in profits as well. You know, lunches will have a nice little pop and a, a bigger boom than normal. And, um, you know, dinner as well. And we're a late night eatery, so it always helps us because they know that even if they get out of their conference, say 8 o'clock, we're still serving till midnight and 2 a.m. And Shannon Walker says her staff is more than prepared for any of the visitors who have come into town for the World Leisure Congress. Reporting from Mobile, I'm Lakia Stinchcomb for News 5.